Hey guys, welcome to Rizzo's Rockin' Records. Uh, Cheryl here with my dad, who wanted me to just add on a few additional things that the Sunday shop is still open. So I'm going to take you through and let you see a couple things about it. Uh, right here we have some CDs, different tapes. If you could see here, we have the Wise Guys, the Great Wall, the Dead. Um, you know, just some fun different things for all you guys that like C have CD players. There's a VH ta VHS tapes for those that have a VCR. Uh, we also have records as well. And then we have some that are being shifted over to that six day a week market that I was telling you about. You guys are going to love that. Um, Dad, is there anything in particular that you want to show off right now for the rest of the crowd? Yeah. All right, well, let us know. A lot of people have lost things. I'll give you a story of somebody who found something here at my shop. Uh, Roy Calhoun put one album out in 1964. He's a, a country western actor. He also made an album for his fans. He only printed 1,000 copies. And a guy from uh, Tennessee was up and went through my whole collection. And then he yelled out, oh, my God, you got it. <laughs> and he was so ecstatic that he found Roy Calhoun's fan club album. And it was here. So you guys that are out of state, come on down. We got thousands and thousands of great rock and roll ready for you to buy for a buck you can put your whole collections back mention from where you're at and who's that oh and here here's a prize item <coughs> printed 1964 original beatles bootleg uh, hot, live at the hollywood bowl i'm selling it for 600 on eBay and online, it's going for $3,000, 3000 bucks. There was only 3,000 copies made of this bootleg from the famous bootlegger. And um, I got one of them. Thank you.